It's called a statistic. The math is simplistic, you see. Section A. What is statistic? A stat is a number, some foods are cucumber. Yeah. A lot of people think statistics is confusing. They see the formulas and get intimidated. Well, when it comes down to it, statistics is a language test. The math is very simple. You just need to understand the language. To make this easier, we've tried to show the relationship between some of the terms for you on the statistical family tree, which is printed on the insert card that comes with this video. Use it, and ye shall conquer many lands, and also your statistics test. There are a couple ways for us to look at the word statistics. First, let's think of statistics in the big picture. Okay, so say you've got a bunch of numbers, or what we call numerical data. Statistics is the science of taking out a portion of that numerical data, studying it, and figuring out what that portion of numerical data tells us about the data as a whole. This leads us to our second way of looking at statistics, or shall we say, the little picture. The broad science of statistics involves using smaller groups of numbers to tell us stuff about bigger groups of numbers. These smaller groups of numbers are the statistics themselves. In other words, the broad science of statistics is composed of lots of itty-bitty statistics. It's a classic case of the part making up the whole. For instance, let's take another look at the big picture. Statistics is a lot like an impressionist painting. When you look at it from afar, you see one thing. But after a closer look, there's more than originally meets the eye. If you're studying statistics, what you're doing is studying how to make sense of data. Now that you have a grip on what statistics is, we can look at its components and learn how to use them.